Booster bundle. I wonder if I should just get four of them. I wonder if. Let me take the box. Because I kind of want the box. Alright, leaving Kohl's and I got the goods. There was a lady there. I did not know that there was a lady walking when it pulled out my camera. So that is great. But leaving my Kohl's location and we got the new Halloween trick or treat booster packs for Pokemon, which are probably some of the new Pokemon products that I'm most excited about, to be honest, because one, I love Halloween. Halloween's my absolute favorite. And two, Gengar is my husband's favorite Pokemon and all the promotion and the pack art and everything is Gengar. So that's super exciting. And they let me take the box. So I was really excited that they let me take the box for that. <laughs> this works. I found the new booster bundle packs. They're called Booster. And these have Gengar and Pikachu on them. And there's 40 mini packs in a bag. I did not know that. This is what the packs look like, or the bags. Um, I found these at Kohl's, which is super random. And then this is what it says on the back. So spooky surprises lurk inside. Share Pokemon fun and excitement on the spookiest night of the year with a bundle of booster packs. Inside you'll find 40 mini packs, each containing three colorful cards from the Pokemon trading card game. And it says trick or trade booster bundle. So these were $17.99 each. And you're also able to use your Kohl's cash on them, which is really exciting. So one of these only ended up being like two bucks, but we grabbed four of them. And now I found out that I guess you can complete the set with only one of these bags, but Gengar is Brandon's favorite Pokemon. So I wanted to get a few extras. So there's 30 cards in the set and hopefully we're able to complete it. I thought that these would be pretty appropriate because they a little spooky. Brandon's kind of here for moral support. He's feeling a little sick, so he may not talk as much. We are just going to open this up and mm. see um, how these packs look. So these are going to be like the packs you would get from the dollar store. So they're only going to have the three cards inside. Well. Oh my god. These are a dollar. A dollar a piece at like, I mean, not this specific pack, but a pack of three cards is a dollar typically. Like a dollar tree, they used to be anyway. Family dollar, you'd pay three dollars for two of them, and now they're five dollars for two packs. They rose the price. So six cards for five dollars. I'll kind of show you guys the artwork. So here it is again. Little. Gengar and Pikachu on the front. It says trick or trade. And then this is the information on the back. I love Halloween too, so this is very exciting for me. Halloween is my favorite holiday and I love all the little Halloween goodies. So I'm excited to open these. So do you want me to open it first? Do you want to open one first? You can open one. You want me to open it first? Okay, so this is gonna be our first pack. I'll probably zoom in on the camera up there and editing. I don't know if there's like a trick, like if there's a good card, I don't really know. Well, our hollow is right up <clears> on the <throat> front here. We have Gorgeist um, right here. And there is, oh my god, there's a little Pikachu pumpkin, so almost like the Celebrations cards in the corner. So cute. Let's see what the next one is. Phantom. This one is not hollow, so these are only hollow on the hollow cards, but we have Phantom here. And Sinistee. So these are our first 
three cards that we have are hollow. I don't know if each pack comes with a hollow either. He's gonna be in charge of sleeving and I'm just gonna kind of open these and he's gonna mm. see if we already have it or not. Very excited with this new setup. I did finally get one of these tripods over here. So um, this is our first video using it. The lighting is a bit wonky in this room still, but hopefully you guys like this still. Oh no. I wonder if they're going to be the same three cards, too. So we have Gorgeist again, so let's see if we get... No, it's a different one. We have Zubat! Oh my gosh, and he's knitted! Oh, he is so cute. I absolutely love the artwork on this Zubat. And then we have another Sinistee, so we got two duplicates already. And I'm just grabbing them kind of at random, and hopefully we get the, the whole set. <coughs> Okay, we have a new one to begin, or to start off here, Hatterene. So it looks like the first card in here is going to be your hollow card. So I guess each pack does come with a hollow. Love the artwork on this one. Let's see. Oh no, we got another Zubat. And a Mischievous. So we got two new ones out of this. Another one that I don't remember what that um, set is, unfortunately, but I do just love these little Pikachu pumpkins. I think these are so cute, but... This is the one that I think we wanted the most. What is it? Oh my, look at him. Bro, look at it. That's a really cool one. The art style on here is crazy. I, again, don't know what set this is from unfortunately, but um, I think this is the card that a lot of people will probably want the most out of this set, obviously, because, you know, he is the star of the show on the pack art here, but I do like the art style for this one. I don't really know what he's doing up the stairs licking him. That's a little unsanitary, but um, he is cute, and I do like him a lot, so... Ooh, and we have a Cubone! So this is another new one. Cubone is super cute. Look at him hugging that little bone there. Oh my god, adorable. Beat and headbutt are the, <laughs> the moves. Um, still really cute. Love the art style on here. And then the last one is Poltergeist, which I don't believe we have yet. Very, very colorful card here. I love the background. It's giving me Dr. Seuss vibes though, to be honest. Um, a lot from this set. I do think that this is Darkness of Blaze, and I think that the three on the whatever is Battle Styles. But I could be absolutely wrong, so I should probably stop saying that. Um, so far, so good. I think there is a Pikachu in this set too. Oh, oh, oh. Y'all, it is a Mimikyu. Oh, this one is so cute. Look at the little bedazzles. Oh, uh, heel jamming. That is so funny. I absolutely love the artwork on this one for sure. And there's the Pikachu card. So we got Mimikyu and Pikachu, which is super fun. Look at his red cheeks on there. Super, super cute. I love the and the styles that they chose to do these on. So a lot of these are just going to be reprints and then they're going to have just the little pumpkin Pikachu in the corner is what it looks like to me. Um, but still super cute. Love this. And the last one is Nickit. So we got three new cards out of this pack, which is super exciting. I'm not sure what Nickit is holding in his mouth there. Um, but he's cute. If you guys want to do the card trick, the best way to do it is to open it upside down and take the first card and put it to the back so that way your hollow will be the last card. I don't think that there's any like V cards or V max cards in this set. They're all going to pretty much be like this but we have Hatena there which is the of Hatarina. So we have Hatena now which is still super cute. I've not seen this symbol before so I don't know which set this is from. Dusclops, which is another new one. Obviously love the spooky Pokemon that they picked. I'm trying to think what would be a good Pokemon to put in this Halloween set that we haven't opened or seen yet. Fade to black. Very dramatic. So let's see what our hollow is going to be. It is another Hatterene. Yeah, I'm going to try and do this card trick each one so it's not so revealing. So we're going to try and do this the the right way I should say but 
you know, if somebody actually buys these to give out to kids for Halloween, I think that would be the coolest oh, thing. Dude. Like, can you think about going trick-or-treating and somebody giving you a Pokemon card pack? Like, this is literally ingenious, and I think this whole idea really just does kind of bring it back to the kids. Like, if people are able to find these, if they're, you know, going to be in other stores besides Kohl's. But you got to think about Kohl's demographic, too, like the grandmas and stuff that will buy these to actually pass out to kids on Halloween. It's just super fun. So we have a new one here again. This is Litwick. I should probably start like holding these up more so I don't have to zoom in. I don't know how the quality is going to be or the focus on these, but um, for now, we're just going to work with it. So we have Litwick here. And would you look at that? There he is, right there, Duskull. One of my favorite, like, ghost Pokemon, to be honest. I just love him. He's so cute. I love his back with his little bones on it. So adorable. So, love that one. And let's see what our holo is. Oh! Okay, Mewtwo. Wasn't really expecting that for a Halloween set, but the artwork on this is nuts honestly i mean look at that like striking move this is obviously like you should i guess think like mewtwo for halloween maybe i i don't know but life sucker is his move so that's kind of interesting um but yeah really really cool artwork on this one i've not seen this artwork before again this symbol i'm not familiar with this set we're gonna <clears throat> try and do the card trick here again so last one ooh, uh -oh. something happened to that one all right we have a another pikachu another dust skull and it is a new card dusk noir which is the final evolution for dust skull um this one is damaged though so i do hope that we get another one of these We'll see. Or if they did like maybe some of the trainers and the trainers were like in Halloween costumes. Like something a little bit different. Oh, I gotta whoosh. Right? Yes? No? I think I did that wrong. I did that wrong. It's, it's, it's the middle one. It's now. the middle one now. So we're gonna... Okay. <laughs> I screwed up. We got another Zubat. <clears throat> we got another Nicket. And a new holo that we don't have, Travant, which is definitely very interesting, but we do have the Phantom already, so that makes sense. My friend tried to show me the full set, but I was like, don't spoil it for me, please. <laughs> so, moving along here. Oh my god, Spinarak! It's a new one! Look at the artwork on this one, though. Look at this background. Why does it look like there's a magic heart back there? I don't really know what's going on there. So cute, love that. Spinarak is adorable for a bug Pokemon, I will not lie, so that's a new one. Poltergeist is a duplicate, and our holo is Ooh. another Gengar, which is what we wanted, so I'm sure Brandon will probably sleep this one up. We're gonna compare all of our Gengars at the end. Oops, sorry. We're moving on. You're gonna have to count those and see how many we have, because I don't know where we're at, um, but- How many are in the set? 30. So, we will see. Phantom, I don't, I think we already have this one. Yeah. Pretty sure we already have this one. Yeah, it was like the first one I think we pulled was Phantom. And our next one is Dusclops again. So, our hollow is... Miss Muggus. Oh, this is, Miss um... Magus. Uh, this one is really nice too. I like the little plants. I don't know where these Pokemon are at because it looks like this one is chilling with Gengar somewhere with those steps. I don't really know what's going on there, but maybe they're at a Halloween party, you know? Um, super, super cool artwork on these. I think they did a really, really good job with these. <clears throat> uh, 19, 20. So we're missing 10 cards. And I'm pretty sure that, like, you know, the hollows are the hollows. There's not a chance to get all of the commons as hollows. Otherwise, we would have probably run into that by now. Yes. Oh, we have a new one. This is Hatrum. Love that. Love that for us. Spiral Drain is the move, which is pretty interesting. Um, super, super cute. Love her. Haunter. So there's probably a Ghastly in the set. So we don't have Ghastly yet. 
Willow Wisp is the move for that one, but this Haunter artwork is really, really nice. I do really like that. So that was one that we definitely needed. And then our hollow is another Mimic Cube. We just better recount them, you know? So let's see. Let me know if you guys have found these anywhere yet and where you found them. Because so far, I think the only store that's gotten them is Kohl's. And I don't know what's up with that. Like, I don't know when these are technically supposed to be released. Because I don't even think these went live on Pokemon Center yet. Because I thought they were supposed to go on Pokemon Center first. And then come to the store. So, oh, Lampent. We have another new one. So now we're at 25 cards, so we're only missing five cards in this set. Murkrow, okay, another new one. So now we're only missing four cards in this set. I love Murkrow. I really want a shiny Murkrow on Pokemon Go because I just think that he looks really cool. Um, and let's see what our hollow is. Chandelier! So we got three new ones out of this pack. I always think that's so exciting when you get three new ones. And then also by opening all these you can see that there is a difference like in between the packs. Like we've gotten some duplicates but with some new ones they're not just the same packs over and over and over. Which I do really like. We have 26 cards y'all. Our 15th recount and we have 26 cards. So we are missing four cards. Is that including mm -hmm. that one? Yes. Okay, so we're missing four cards, and we still would like another Dusk Noir. So, oh my goodness, we got a lot more. There's a lot of packs left. Um, I don't know how many we've necessarily opened. All right, let's just keep on with it. We're only missing four <clears throat> cards. Whoops, I didn't flip. It's okay. It's a duplicate uh, holo card. So we have another Travant here. Eridos, that's a new one. That's a new one for our spinner act. So what's the final, or is that the final evolution? Does it only evolve twice? Yeah, it only evolves twice. That's kind of a bummer. So, okay, so we have that one there. Spider Net is the ability. And the last card we have is a, another Murkrow, which we already have. Complete this set. I'm trying not to look at the hollow card. We're gonna put it to the back. Let's see. Another spinner rack. another spinner rack. I didn't even think about that for this set. That is literally the cutest thing. Look at that little one right there. So cute. So cute. So cute. Shut up. I love. I love that. I love that. I wish that was a hollow. I love that. Okay, what's our hollow gonna be? Another Dusk Noir, and I don't think this one is damaged. A little bit in the corner. I don't know. It's definitely not centered though. You can see how thicker it is at the bottom there. <laughs> oh, la la. I. <laughs> so we're having some issues with Dust Noir, but it is definitely better than the one that we had before, I guess. Um, so now we're only missing two cards. I think we're only missing two cards. I don't know what two cards those are, but um, hopefully, you know, we get them within this first first thing here this first pack of packs bag thing. bag of packs bag of packs bag of packs uh litwick we already have sinistee we already have we got another hollow that we did not have dark so cry. this one's dark cry looking extra spicy extra spicy and dark on this one i think we're only missing one card <laughs> y'all i wish i knew what it was but at the same time you know it's not as fun if we don't, you know, keep it, keep it going, keep it going. You so, see what it is? No. 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 We're only missing one card. We have Cubone. What's Marowak? There's probably a Marowak card that we don't have. Because Ghastly. so far, oh, and Ghastly. I don't know if they're in the set. I don't know. My friend had the whole thing on her phone, but I didn't really want to look at a Cubone. Another Pompkapoo. Oh my goodness, I love you. And the hollow is another Trevant. This is gonna get tricky. What if we <laughs> open up all of these packs and we still don't get the one card? Also, the seal on these is like kind of busted. Like it just pops right open in the middle. Like I'll show you guys. Like if I go to open this, okay, this one. Yeah, look at that. Just pops right, right open. Don't open that pack yet, but. All right, let's see. Can we get the 
the 30th card. We need one more card to complete the set. Hatram. Another Haunter. And our hollow is another Dusk Noir. So the centering looks better on this one. And it definitely looks better on this one. And I mean, it's got some corner damage, but that's probably the best one, to be honest, out of all of them. So we'll just slide that one right in there. All right. You guys, we are only missing one card. I looked at the hollow for this, so that's my bad. But we have Miss Megas, Eridos. And there it is! We did it! So we have all 30 cards in the Halloween set. And we got little Ghastly here. I mean, it makes sense that you would have the full Ghastly evolution in the pack, especially with this sick pack art. So we're just gonna kinda go through the comments here real quickly. So we have Ghastly, we have Punkaboo, we have Eridos, Eridos, I can't say Pokemon names, <coughs> Murkrow, Lampent, Haunter, which is sick, Hatram, Spinarak, Litwick, Duskull, Zubat, Nicket, Dusclops, Hat Hatena, Poltergeist, Mistrevis, Sinisty, the beautiful Pikachu, Cubone, and Phantom. So those are the commons that you can get. And then these are all of the holo cards that you can pull. So the first one, obviously, star of the show, at least in this household, is Gengar. Love Gengar. We have Miss Magus there. Mewtwo, forgot about that one. That was sick. We only got one Mewtwo out of all those packs that we opened, so that's kind of nuts. Um, Darkrai, also super cool. Love the artwork on there. Uh, Travant, which is also a really nice one. Hatterene. Gorgeist, which I think we only got one of. We might have gotten two of that one. Mimikyu, which is probably one of my personal favorites from this set. Chandelier, and then lastly, Dusk Noir, which gave us a hard time. Again, these were found at Kohl's, $17.99 in the toy section, so be on the lookout. Super exciting, very happy with this. I had fun, I haven't opened up Pokemon cards in a minute, but hopefully you guys like this video. If you guys find these, let me know where you found them at in the comments down below. Happy early, early Halloween, and I will see you guys again very, very soon. Peace out, Girl Scouts.